A lot of pressure has been put upon her. I don't know if it's from growing or what. Leave it. Same thing. She's starting to twist to meet me. So Her job okay. is to meet you. Here, sit. Here. Here. Sit. Good. Out. Leave it. Good. Get her off of it. Out. Good. Good girl. You're one big giant mess, Miss Rasta. Good pup. This gal's got a problem with being physically handled. She's going to be in the show ring. She's going to be groomed extensively. So she's going to need to learn. And already, just because I'm handling her around the neck, she's already starting to get a little wiggy. And basically, we've done this with this dog before. All I'm doing is controlling her. I'm not beating up on her. I'm not putting any more, putting any more force on her than it takes to stop her moving her head. That's it. Good lass. I'm rewarding still, calm behavior. By the absence of pressure. Every time she fights, she creates her own pressure. My hands don't move. The tension in my hands doesn't change. Good girl. When she stops struggling, I reward that. With the absence of pressure, she starts to lick and mouth. I simply hold my grip. Good girl. This is something the owners need to engage in a little bit more frequently because she gets really, really ditzy when you handle her around the head and the face. Good girl. So it becomes a trial to remove equipment. Out. Leave it. She gets a little grippy. Good dog. She starts tossing her head around. And the only thing we're after is to teach her to stop doing that. Because it becomes a problem. She starts getting frightened when nothing is happening. And she starts getting really, really hysterical and starts flouncing around like a wet rag. That's not going to work for her in the ring. Good. Very good. See that? Yeah. Good dog. We don't want it to be a point of consternation or pressure, but she's not allowed to escape this until she calms down. And although you can't see it because she's a big black blob on a yellow surface, there's a lot of pressure and tension in her head and neck. And all I'm doing is holding her quietly. Good girl. Okay. And waiting until she relaxes. The whole point is to teach her that she's not allowed to fight. Talk back up and do it again.